Hi guys, welcome to another video from Holy Outdoor. We have done an extensive review of the best digital mobile radios or DMR radios for short. In this video, we will review the top three radios and discuss all their key features and what things to consider before you pick the best one for you. Price information and all radios mentioned in the video are available in the description. You can also find a more detailed analysis and review of the 8 best DMR radios on our website wholeyoutdoor.com. Before we dive in, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss a video from us. So let's start. Number 3. TYT MD380 DMR slash Moto TRBO Radio This is a DMR portable radio that operates on a two-way mode and a time division multiple access technology. TDMA technique enables you to share a particular frequency with other users based on time without communication disruptions or interference. It runs on DMR Tier 1 and 2, which makes it ideal for both amateur and business use. For specificity, it operates on the UHF band and a frequency range of 400 to 470 MHz. It supports up to a thousand channels. This gives you access to communicate with multiple talk groups within your region. However, for this to happen, you need to program these channels on your radio. The good news is that the radio comes with a USB programming cable and software. Therefore, you need to install the software on a computer, then use the USB cable to connect the radio to the computer. Once you're set, you can engage in private calls, group calls, and text messaging in digital mode. This radio runs on a 2000 mAh battery that is powerful and long-lasting once fully charged. To get an idea for its battery life, it can be used for around 9 to 12 hours with a stand-in time of around 52 hours, but 2 hours if used continuously. For easy navigation and control, the radio has a color LCD display where you can see all the operations as you feed them in. And to make your work easier, the radio comes with an easy to read and comprehend user manual. You can make reference to the manual whenever in doubt. The TYT MD380 is really simple to use. One issue though is that USB programming is not supported on Mac computers. Overall, it's the ideal DMR radio for amateurs. Number 2. Radiodity GD77 DMR Two-Way Radio this is a dual-band and two-way radio that is designed for amateur use but can be used for commercial purposes. Thus, the radio operates on very high frequency and ultra-high frequency. Besides, this DMR handheld radio operates on both Tier 1 and Tier 2 DMR modes and frequency ranges of 136 to 174 MHz and 400 to 470 MHz. In turn, this will allow you to use the radio both for personal and commercial use. Additionally, it has an inbuilt variable frequency oscillator mode that enables you to fine-tune frequencies and find that sweet spot. Also, the radio has the capacity of a maximum of 1024 channels, which will allow you to communicate with multiple tour groups within your region. It comes with a programming USB cable that's plug and play. Once connected to your Windows computer, you can program the radio to your specifications and preference. GD77 is versatile and doesn't only support calls, but also instant messaging. To effectively use this option, you need to input your user ID when programming the radio. To sum it up, the pros of the Radiodity GD77 are that it runs on a powerful and long-lasting battery, it's light and portable, it can be customized to suit both new and experienced users, and the audio is clear. On the downside, channel programming on Mac or Linux is not supported, and the LCD doesn't have a brightness control level. Overall, it's good for both commercial and amateur use. Number 1. BTEC DMR 6X2 Dual Band Two-Way Radio BTEC DMR 6X2 is a two-way radio and versatile dual-band DMR radio that operates on the very high and ultra-high frequency ranges of 136 to 174 MHz and 400 to 480 MHz, respectively. It's easy to use with a solid and robust structure. Also, it comes with a 2100 milliamp battery and an extra-powerful 3100 milliamp battery. It is designed for both amateur and business use. 
therefore you will only need one radio that you can use for your commercial and personal needs. It features a large and bright color display that measures 1.77 inches. With this, you can see the functions on the display screen at a glance. And one of the best things is that it has adequate memory. It can store 4,000 channels, 10,000 tour groups, and 200,000 contacts. It features and operates on an inbuilt GPS function that you can use to determine user locations. But that's not all. It has an inbuilt audio recorder that you can use to record audio for future reference while making a call. To sum it up, the main pros of the BTEC DMR6X2 are that it's a multi-purpose and easy-to-use radio, it has a solid and robust structure, it has a large internal memory, it's water and dust resistant, its battery is powerful and long-lasting, and the adjustable channel scanning. On the downside, like many other DMR radios, its programming software is only Windows compatible and you need to download a DMARC ID from RadioID.org before DMR systems can allow your radio to operate online. Overall, it's the best DMR radio we have reviewed. So what do you think? Which of these three is the best DMR radio for you? Or do you think another radio is better? Tell us in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Have an awesome day.